welcome to my channel if this is your first time being here and welcome back if you've been here before now if you saw the last week's video you saw where i allowed my braid pattern to be set in a video by itself and um, well rubber band pattern and so in this rubber band pattern i'm going to crochet some box braids so in order to crochet box braids the right way you have to come at it at two different cross crochet angles for each section so this particular section you saw me come in at the side and then um the front and back is where you're going to see the next or top and bottom so it really didn't work for me coming from the top so i'm coming from the bottom for that second um that second crochet um uh, piece of hair to come through because it needs to be pretty thick in order for it to completely cover the hair and my hair is pretty thick as you see now you're gonna see um how i pull everything through and start just sectioning the hair in three so i can start braiding now although there are rubber bands here once i start the braiding process the hair completely covers the rubber band so now you see that i'm sectioning it in three parts but now as i start braiding it i don't like the smoothness that is not taking place so i start this braid all over again and you're going to see me start that all over again and once it's completely braided then of course i move on to the next one now as i'm braiding i'm twisting and braiding twisting and braiding twisting and braiding so it's like a little bit of a twist with the one individual hair that i have in one hand and i twist it around so it can be braided and so on and so forth one other thing you see me doing is allowing more of the gel to be placed on each strand of hair as i braid it so i'll twist a little braid that one and then i'll grab some gel for the next braid that i'm twisting around so that it can really be in sync with the hair and it doesn't stick out <laughs> so that's really the the process of all of the braids that i'm doing i'll do one complete section i may do the back on camera but everything else was done off camera now this style took about four hours for me to do this is absolutely my longest style that i've done on my hair it normally takes me about an hour and a half really for each section and um this one took four hours for this complete section and when i say sections like when i rubber band everything that might take an hour and a half and um, once i add the hair to start box braiding that might take an hour and a half but this particular time it took four four hours to um add the rubber band process the um the braids in the rubber band now i'm just gonna actually get myself out of the way and allow you to watch the rest of this video and i hope you like this style because i did oh and one more thing that i know that people um wonder i allowed this to be worn for three weeks it lasted three weeks for me and the way that i'm doing it all right thanks for watching enjoy the rest of the video